Welcome back to Selly Entertainment. I'm your host, Orion Vincent, and tonight we got the Langley Eagles versus the Chilliwack Bruins. With me, as always, classic co host, Sean Simonson. Hello, everybody out there in hockey land. I'm happy to be here hanging out with all of you, and we're taking a look here at the U11 A4 hockey teams and we're coming at you straight out of twin rinks langley beautiful british columbia canada and in the white we got the chilliwack bruins with griffith in goal in the blue paint and then the langley eagles with hudson take a look at him yeah there he is simonson the langley eagles in black and blue the chilliwack bruins in white uh, I believe they got a little bit of red on the crest. And I'm really excited for this game, Simonson. Um, Chilliwack Bruins look sharp. So do the Langley Eagles. I've seen the Eagles uh, previously in the Remembrance Day Classic, and they look pretty good, Simonson. They didn't get the L, or they didn't get the W then, so I know they're going to come out hungry knowing that I'm there filming this game, Simonson. Right on. Here we go. Let's break right into this. Okay, we got the Chilliwack Bruins streaking through. Takes a high shot, and that one goes over the net now. It's the... Eagles who collect the puck trying to get out of their own zone but it is the Bruins who hold it in fire another wild shot at the net and that one is snared down by Hudson Yeah, nice easy glove by Hudson there's the Langley Eagles black number two trying to put the puck in deep there it's a little bit of a battle with the Bruin number eight. Oh, number two Bala throws the body on black there from behind Oh, massive body work there, down behind the Bruins goal there. We got number two just showing that they can throw their weight around. Yeah, physical game. There's Pare there. Oh, look at that, Simonson. Number 12, Pare just hit Thompson right in the shoulder, point blank at the shooting range. Just let it go. Yeah, Thompson took that one like a champ. Here we go, going back the other way. We got a player down on the ice here, it looks like. Yeah, Simonson, if you look, it kind of happened behind the play, but they're right there, Petit. Oh, right there. You can see he got slashed right in the ankles. It started with Petit, and then Thompson slashed uh, number 18 Hunter right in the ankles. And Hunter's obviously in some discomfort there. Hopefully he's all right. Devastating. Here we are. The puck comes out, and it is broken out of the Langley Eagle zone. And we got a race for the puck going the other way, and nobody can control it. And then we got a Bruin who falls down. Big oh! save, and there's a rebound and a goal from the cap. In. Number 11, our Arbuthnot scores, assisted by number 17, McCray. And this is our official apology in advance if we mess up your names. We're just a couple guys. That is true because I am good at screwing things up. Here we are. <laughs> let's, so let's check out this replay. Great, Banks bo it. Great board work. Banks it right off the boards, uses it, and then there's a race to the puck there. The Bruins player has it, but can't quite collect it. And as he's trying to get it, he loses his balance and goes down. There's a shot. Nice save there originally by Griffith, but then the rebound is picked up and buried. Yeah, buried by the captain. And look at this, Sally. He's going down for this, the old scoop of the ice cream. Kind of loses his edge, which kind of, I like that, Simon. It adds a little bit of effect to the Sally. Oh, absolutely. I mean, if it looks like like you're falling down then it looks like you don't know what you're doing <laughs> that's right here you go the Chilliwack Bruins in the Langley Eagle zone trying to push the puck towards the net it's a three on one there and wow what a shot block by number five Charles to take away that opportunity look at that right there number 16 trying to dish an 18 shield can't quite get it off because of the excellent work of number five Charles from oh, the Langley Eagles absolutely it was the extra effort there to extend that leg out and then get that puck out of harm's way here's number nine flying down takes a shot Shot. Ooh, nice save there by Griffith. Uh, Griffith with the big glove. Langley Eagles collecting the puck, holding it in the zone of the Bruins, trying to put it down low. Number two throws the body on an eagle as the Bruins start to soar. It should be the Eagles that are starting to soar, but it's the Bruins who are thumping into the Eagle zone. Number two taking the outside lane, has a shot and a big save, and another save. And, oh, did that go in, Simonson? The Bruins have just tied this game up. Oh, yeah, they did. Wow, okay, yeah, they went in there with force, and then they took the shot the first save was made there by Hudson and then after that the rebound was left for whoever picks it up yeah number two Nixon there had the shot and number three Bala collects the rebound he just sneaks it blocker side in between the armpit of Hudson and the Bruins have tied this game up and look at that Selly the Falcon I can fly! Hey! Soar high, 
pie in the sky. Anyways, 1-1. One, one. We got it all knotted up here in the first period. We've got the Eagles flying through. 14. Got nobody on him. Takes a shot. Nice save there by Griffith. Yeah, the puck right in front there. Griffith covers it up. No damage dealt there. Simonson. There's number 16. LaPierre breaks into the Eagles zone with the puck. Trying to go through all of the Eagles. Puck gets loose there. Oh, wow, Simonson. Did you see that? Number 12, Pare, prevented a goal. Watch this. Number 18, Schill has it. The puck's going in. And look at that awareness by Pare of the Langley Eagles to prevent that goal. Absolutely. And in the background, we had a yard sale there by number four selling his gloves. Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, it's uh, when you go to the hockey games and they have all the hockey gear out there, the donation signs. Oh, good times, good times. That one's gobbled up there by Hudson. He holds it and gets a face off. Here we are. There's the drop of the puck, and it's in the corner on the far side. They're battling there on the half boards. Two players from each team come in, and it is the Chilliwack Bruins who prevail, and something's happened. Yeah, there's a whistle on the play. I think right there, Bruce Chuck the hit on Bel Air, number six. And Bel Air went right back with the elbow on Bruce. And I believe he's going to get called the retaliation, Simonson. We've said this many times. The first one, usually, if it goes unclean, don't retaliate. They usually are going to get you on that. Absolutely. you got to keep yourself composed there on the ice or else uh, if you're the guy retaliating, usually you're the one going to sit. Yeah, they're, if the referee misses the first one, he's going to get the second. And there's the puck is scrabbling in front of the net. The Eagles trying to clear it. Number seven has the puck, tries to fire it on the boards. Bruins trying to keep it in, holding the line. They do, but an Eagles there to soar away. Nope, gets turned right back around to a Bruin number four. Cripps has it, has a shot, and a nice save by Hudson to swallow it up and slow the play down a little bit here. Absolutely, another face-off right here to the left of Hudson, and there's a shot blocked, and there's oh, another shot blocked wow. again. Wow, what? we're going to have to take a look at that. Look at this save right here. Number two, Nixon. Look at that pad save by Hudson. To, he's, oh man, that was beautiful, Simonson. The awareness of position on the ice in the blue paint is amazing, immaculate. But here we are, we got a scramble right in the neutral zone. And we've got the Eagles, they're the ones that are flying with this sucker. And they're throwing it around, treating these Bruins like jokes for the moment. But <laughs> let's see what happens, it's right on the goaltender. Griffith, and he slows her down. Slows it down. Face off in the Bruins zone. Eagles trying to get away with it. There's the Bruins. Feeds it right back. Oh, to the point. Par intercepts. Has a shot. Griffith makes the initial save. Whistle is blown dead. A little bit of rough stuff after. Plays going to go on on the face off. Eagles still fighting with it. And uh, that's going to be the end of the first period, it looks like, Simonson. It's all tied up going into the second. Knotted up like my shoelaces at 1-1. <laughs> going into the second period, we've got the Eagles coming in. In, trying to go on the far wide side and then sends it back to the point. And he's looking, looking, looking. There's the shot. Goes for a tip, but it's not getting through to the net. Back to the point again. Who's that? Number 19. Put. I don't know how to pronounce it, but they have a shot and a save. Yeah, Griffith covers it up. Chilliwack Bruins turn it around the other way. Number six, Bel Air fighting with a puck. Throws it in front and Hudson covers that puck up. Uh, face off there. The Bruins kind of win it. It's a battle. The race is on. It's the Eagles who takes off. Takes flight. Number four, Anderson. Anderson, look at that speed. Simonson turns on the Jets. Has a shot and he scores. The Langley Eagles. Oh, and the Eagles selling to boot there, Simonson. Oh, wow. That was a real good looking goal. As we take a look, right off the face off, you think that it's the Bruins that have possession, but no. Number four, Anderson. He takes it from his own zone. He goes right through all the players of the Bruins around the last defender and then the goaltender. Oh, and the ender there. And did you see how that all started? He came out of nowhere like an eagle swooping up its prey. And he's showing the eagle Sally right there, Simonson. Hungry for that puck like it was a salmon out of the river. Exactly. And it's 2-1. to one. The Langley Eagles over the Chilliwack Bruins. Face off in the neutral zone. Eagles gain the zone. Number eight, keeper puck goes down. Down low, and 17, McCray picks it back up. Throws it out front. Nobody's home. Bruins going to collect the puck. Throw it up the boards. Can't quite get it out. The Eagles hold it back in. A little bit of a battle. The point man still hold. Great job by the Langley Eagles point man to hold that puck in. Absolutely. Yeah, no. It's very strong on that line there. And there, here and now, the puck is down below the goal line. And it's behind 
uh, Griffith uh, there. Yeah, Griffith, uh, Bruins Puts goal center. Puts in front and scores, Simonson! Oh, wow, you look away for a second and things happen. <laughs> Let's take a replay in a second after the boys get their props. Yeah, that's hockey, you can't you can't blink. Look at that, thrown from the corner. Uh, I think that was from Keeper who threw it. And right there, McCray picked up that garbage that was out front and it's the damage is dealt, Simonson. That's right, Griffiths was, uh, Griffith was a little late to the show there to get that puck. Oh, it was a big scramble in front. It was hard for him to see. It was a lot of bodies. But, uh, I mean, McCray read the play, had his eye on the puck, eye on the prize, and he cashed in on it, Simonson. Oh, look at that. Is that a save? Because that's a beauty if I've ever seen one. That's a big save by Hudson on number 18, Shill. Look at him. Just hug that puck with a pad. A knuckler. He didn't really know what it was going to do. And that's the problem with a knuckle puck. You never know which way it's actually going to bounce. Here's another shot and another save there. Directed to the corner. And now it's the Eagles with it. They throw it out into the neutral zone. Now it's the Bruins trying to make dangles. They're getting all scrambled up there like eggs. Yeah, big, and it's back the other way for the Eagles. Big battle there with the Eagles. Oh, I thought the Eagles were going to pull away with that one. But it's the Bruins who have the puck. Oh, and he gets taken down by Black. Ackerman, he's not happy, Simonson. Look at this, number two Black there is fighting with Ackerman, and look at him, he grabbed the inside of his knee as he was twirling down, and he, that's a dangerous play. Well, he knew he was going down, so he had to grab Ackerman there to make sure he came with him, and you know what, he got away with it. Yeah. Here we are, number four, Anderson shot! Oh. Nice save there by Griffith. Yeah, he definitely got away with it, and a nice save. And there's Ackerman again, number seven, trying to go all the way down the middle but he can't break the Eagles apart Shill gives it right to Ackerman Ackerman has a shot and a nice save by Hudson puck down low in the corner rung around the boards by an Eagle Eagles trying to take flight number five kind of loses his bounce a little bit but Black's there to re recover for him gets it out of their zone now it's back in their zone Simonson here we are and then they try to clear it but the attempts are just not working out now the Bruins have it it's two on two right strong to the net on Hudson but he keeps it out and now it's back there the Eagles get it and they're trying to soar away it's all the way down in the Bruins end here and I don't know if they're gonna call it icing nope there's no icing on the play oh, we missed it Simonson and McCray there collecting the opportunity and there's a goal right there number 11 Arbuthnot scored assisted by McCray and they just capitalized on the Bruins mistake there Simonson wow that was a great positional play there like look at you go in hard after that puck after the Bruins were going slowly thinking maybe it's an icing and then uh, I don't know 17's name but he gives it to uh, Buckman as you said <laughs> our buff not Buckman uh, our buff not I believe uh, all right number 11 <laughs> oh, buries yeah. that one puts it away and says you know what good night yeah, good night. I like I like the effort, Simon. So at least you're making an effort, and that's what counts. We already gave our formal apologies if we mess your name up. Four to one, Langley Eagles over the Chilliwack Bruins. Chilliwack Bruins, number seven, Ackerman in the corner, throws it out front, hits the back of the net, bounces right back to, puts it out front, and what a huge save by Hudson. Did you see that, Simonson? Save? You mean saves? Uh, plural. And then it looks like there's a little rough stuff here, but we're gonna have to take a little look at. Okay, so as they go to throw it out front there. Oh. Big Big save there by Hudson. He gets that and he gets over to the post and then makes a secondary save there. Tries to cover it and it squeaks loose. I don't know if the ref blew it dead, but there's also, uh, you know, everybody's got uh, some words to say to each other. Oh, man. Belair was just shook that he didn't score that. Here's the Langley Eagles in the Chilliwack Bruin zone. Number 10 has a shot. Looks like that might have gone off the helmet or the glove. I'm not too sure. All the way back around. Number 14 throws it out front. The Chilliwack Bruins get away with it. Oh, a little bit of a bail on the side of the screen. In the neutral zone, Nixon, number two, battling with the puck. Puck gets taken away by an eagle, but the Bruins go to collect it. Throws it back down low, and the Bruin right there has a shot and a big save by Hudson, and he covers it up and slow the play down again, Simonson. Hudson's really holding these eagles in here right now, making some real big league saves right when you need them, and there's another one as I'm speaking. Yeah, most definitely. Hudson's playing a really good game as well as Griffith, but the score is what it is. Uh, because of Hudson. It, the Bruins have had lots of chances. There's the Bruins right out front. Oh, Simonson! The puck goes in! Looked like it ricocheted off a skate. We're going to have to have another look at that, but that was number 18, Schill, who had the puck initially and threw the, the, threw the shot there. Let's, let's have a look at this. Let's run this back. There's 18, Schill. So he's curling around with it, making a couple moves. And on the back end, yeah, it does. It hits number 18, Hunter. 
in his skate and it gets redirected in the back of the net. That threw Hudson for a loop. He wasn't expecting that to happen, Simonson. Yeah, once they got to the top of the blue paint there, it was like we were on the prices right and we were playing Plinko because that puck was going every which way. And you know what? That's hard for a goaltender to stop. Bob Barker, Simonson. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the action. Langley Eagles has the puck, throws it to the point. Number six keeps it in. Um, right out front to McCray. McCray can't handle the pass. Langley Eagles taking the shot. Lots of action, lots of swipes, but it's the Bruins goaltender Griffith who held it out. Yeah, here we are. And now it is the Bruins that try to get it out, and we got a penalty on the play for a tripping yeah, call. Yeah, uh, right here, number 11, Arbuthnot, tripped number five, Gladstone, and he did that right in front of the refs. He's not going to get away with that one, Simonson. Very rarely you'll get away with those ones when you do it that blatantly. Here's the face-off puck drop, and it is in the eagle zone. They're trying to get it out of there, but it's held in by the Bruins defenseman. It looks like we got number seven here, walking around, everybody firing a shot and Hudson's there to save the day. Hudson's there again Simonson. Hudson's had a heck of a game and he just continues to have this high caliber game that he's been having. It's four to two. We're going into the third period here Simonson. That actually happened right as the buzzer went. That would have been a buzzer beater but nonetheless our bus not there on the back end. Puck goes and oh 17 scores. The Eagles take flight again. McCray with the goal assisted by number 11 our bus not and the Eagles keep on soaring, Simonson. Here we are, all the way from their own end. Nice breakout pass, and look at those legs just pumping to get to the net. And then look at stop short, backhand shot towards the net, and guess who's there? Number 17 the of the Craig. Eagles. Yeah, Simonson, not to take anything away from that, though. The Griffith made an excellent first save. Um, the puck, it, it just bounced out front, and the Eagles player, McCray, was there to capitalize. But... Uh, he was on the doorstep, he was, and he seen you were home, and you were trying to hide, but he knew, I want to sell you something. <laughs> That's right. He wanted to sell a Cutco knife or something. I didn't want to buy it, though. 5-2, uh, the Langley Eagles over the Chilliwack Bruins thus far. Number 11 from the Bruins has a shot fluttering towards the net, and Hudson is there to say no. All right, here we are. And it's a, a sustained pressure here by the Bruins as of right now. And Hudson is just doing everything he can do to do his job. Well, Simonson, the Bruins have been putting on a lot of pressure all game. They just can't find the goal. Uh, I mean, they've got a couple, but yeah, the pressure continues here, Simonson. But it's the Eagles now pressuring. has a shot. Oh, and Griffith there to make a handful of saves. Ref blows the whistle, and the play is dead. Here we are, back the other way. The Bruins coming through, trying to get through three players. Can't do it quite. And they're battling now on the near side, deep in the corner there. And there's somebody trying to call their own penalty, but just keep going until the whistle goes. And there goes the whistle, Simonson, just like that. Couple Bruins on the floor. I think we're going to get a penalty here or a couple it all starts with Lapierre number 16 of the Bruins and Yates um, number seven of the Eagles and right there Yates throws the body from behind uh, the Bruins doesn't like it he's turning around throwing up his arm so he's gonna throw a body number two Nixon gets in there and it's just a bunch of bodies colliding with each other at this point Simonson they're jumping on each other uh, like it's a trampoline park. What it looks like over there is like, you know when you have a whole bunch of different Play-Dohs that are different colors and they're getting low and you mix them all and oh, make that's, one? Oh, that's what it was. That's what it looked like. Well, a couple players went in the box because of that, Simonson. And plays going to go on, number two, um, Nixon has the shot and he scores the Bruins with the beauty right there. Wow, right upstairs, right where the kids are hanging out. Yeah, right where they're playing the Nintendo Switch, Simonson. And we're going to have to have another look at that. From the depths of his own zone, there's Nixon going coast to coast. Doesn't need anyone at this point. Dangling the Eagles. And then he goes upstairs, and he just decides the power on the Nintendo Switch right there, Simonson. He put him Donkey Kong, and he's ready to go. That was great. Nixon made number five there on the, the Eagles almost break his ankles with that move he made. Yeah, excellent play by the Bruins. And Nixon, that was a heck of a goal. He should be proud of that one. It's 5-3. to three, The Eagles over the Chilliwack Bruins. There you go. Face off. Bruins trying to make something happen. Down by a pair. Need to 
Make something happen to get up there. Has a shot. Nixon does. And Hudson swallows that up. A simple save for Hudson. There's the face off. It's in the Eagles zone. They're trying to get out. But guess who gets it? It's the Bruins. They've been all over that puck. But then the Eagles get it again. They have a chance to get it out. But they can't quite do it. They're still attempting. It's bobbling in between the ring. Oh, wow. Ooh. Nice save from a just a spinning wild shot there from a Bruins player. Yeah, excellent save. And the pressure from the Bruins has been relentless lately. There's the Bruins has another shot and another big save by Hudson. Puck down low in the corner. The Eagles pick it up, get it out of their zone, throw it in the Bruins zone. Sadu number 14 giving chase. Uh, Eagle trailing him. Decides to throw it up the boards, but nobody's there. Um, a Bru uh, an Eagle is, and he holds it in. There's a little bit of a collision. 14's got the, who's that, Anderson? Right here, just a shot, it's deflected, and it's, I see nothing but Eagles in front of the net there, in front of Griffith, but now we're in the far side corner. It's the Bruins who collect it. He's got two Eagles on him, and then he fires one out to the slot. Nobody's home, and it comes all the way to, over to the near side here. Number 12 oh. takes a shot. Look like that hit right in the face. Right in the cage, Simonson. Pare just hits Sadu point blank in the face, but look at Sadu. He's such a champ. He shook it off like nothing even happened. You know what I liked there? I've seen men in beer league that get hit in the face wearing a cage, and then they fall down crying. Yeah, me too, Simonson. And this kid just took it like a champ. Didn't even face him. So all you men in Beer League who are watching this take notes. Yeah, come on now. Alrighty here. Oh, a little bit of a rough stuff here, Simon. So we're getting carried away with our commentary, but there's some jousting going on between the Bruins and the Eagles. And it's a hockey game, and that happens in hockey. Hockey! That's why we're here. Anyways, here, battle behind the net there, behind the Griffith, the goaltender of the Bruins. There's a puck out there. It's fired. But nobody can get it. Oh, nice save. Oh. And Griffith can get it before something wrong had happened. The assistant of the Eagles is just mind-blowing that he didn't bury that. There's Black there. Huge save by Griffith. And Black can't believe his eyes. He's shaking his head and clutching his fists and doesn't understand why he didn't score there, Simonson. That was a mammoth of a save. And you know what? We're going to go back the other way and then there's just going to be a textbook save. Looks like we got an empty net. Empty net here, Simonson. The Bruins down by a pair, trying to make something happen with one minute left in the game. Bruins behind the Eagles net, gets tripped up. Eagles get away with the puck, throw it out right into the neutral zone. Bruins McNulty picks up the puck, but the Eagles' pressure is too much for the Bruins right now. Number nine, Bruce giving chase. Puck gets dumped up right to the point. Has a shot. Oh, it is tipped in by number 14, Cruz. And he gets the empty net goal, putting the Eagles up 6-3. to three. And I'm pretty sure that will be the nail in the coffin here, Simonson, with 32 seconds left in the third. I believe that will seal the deal there, Coach. But here we are. The Bruins are not giving up. Number six, flying by, trying to get one last little streak of glory. Oh, almost right there. Number 14 picks it up down low, dishes it right back up, but the Bruins there to intercept now, and Eagles there to intercept, and it's just a lot of intercepting, Simonson. A lot of bodies, but the Bruins, Ackerman, number seven, has it in the neutral zone, curling around, breaking into the Eagles zone. Look at the speed, he's picking it up, trying to take the outside lane. Simonson, he loses the puck out of his control throws it towards the net and that's gonna be the game six to three the Langley Eagles have defeated the Chilliwack Bruins but not to take anything away from the Bruins the pressure was relentless there and the goaltending was outstanding by both the teams especially Hudson there absolutely I felt like that the uh, Bruins were the harder working team throughout the game but they just didn't get the bounces that they were looking for and the phenomenal goaltending there from Hudson is what helped out the Langley Eagles. Most definitely, Simonson. Thank you and good night from Twin Rinks, Langley, BC.